Hey everyone, it's Andrew Esquivel back here with another review. Now today, I'm going to be reviewing the Antec Digital Power Supply Tester. Now, straight off the bat, I'm going to tell you this thing is great. I love it. It's really high quality and I don't really think you're going to get much better, especially for the price, than the power supply tester I'm about to review from Antec. I'll also put a link in the description to where you can buy it. I bought mine from Excalibur PC, great place, although they kind of charged me a decent price, but then also charged me tax like a few days later. So I feel kind of cheated in that respect. But other than that, great place to buy stuff. Highly rated, apparently, on Google products. Anyway, we're going to get right to it, and uh, this is going to be the power supply tester. All right, so what we got here is a Smilodon Raid Max gaming computer case, accompanied by random internals. But more importantly, what we're testing is a Corsair power supply. Corsair, if you didn't already know, is an amazing brand for power supplies. Highly recommend them. But we're not here to talk about the power supply, really. We're here to talk about this. This is the Antec power supply tester. Now note, it has the ability to accommodate for 24 pin power supplies or 20. As you can see, everything's already hooked up. It has the Molex power connector capability. SATA power, the 4-pin or 8-pin power to the motherboard, and the 6-pin powers uh, for your graphics cards. It also has the floppy drive power connector as well. And as you can see, it's not turned on. But the, real, the, the way to turn it on is, is really simple. You just turn on the power supply, or if you don't have a switch on your power supply, just plug it directly into the wall. Give it a sec, and you see it'll power on. Now, the beauty about this thing is that it's digital readout, as you can see. Very easy to tell. It'll tell you what it's supposed to be and what the actual voltage is right under it. Uh, another great thing about this uh, power supply tester is that if there's any abnormal readings or readings that are dangerous to your computer, it will actually beep, letting you know that something's wrong. Now, being Corsair and their brilliant manufacturing process, there's nothing wrong with this power supply, so thus there's not beeping or anything. But if there was, it would beep. Also, it'll tell you right here in this LED display what exactly is connected. On the top you have your 12 volt line, your 3.3 volt line, and your 5 volt line. Now, keep in mind, it'll say 5 volt right here, and you'll see it's actually 5.1. That is an acceptable range. Um, just a, let's, I think just a few tenths of a volt off from what you're looking at is acceptable. And it will not harm your computer in any way. Now, if it is, let's say, on your 5 volt line, you're getting a 6 or something, it'll beep. And it'll tell you that something is definitely wrong. And that's the beauty about a power supply tester. If you've got a power supply that's from a non-reputable brand or that you think is just malfunctioning, this little buddy right here is going to tell you. And everyone knows, well, anyone that's good at building PCs anyway, will know that if your power supply is bad, you're risking your entire computer build. Because one bad power supply can fry everything if you're not careful. So... This little buddy is going to do wonders for you. And it's from Antec. Antec is a great brand. They're not the best brand in the world, but as far as power supply testers go, you're really not going to get much better than this. Highly recommend it. From the moment I turned it on, I was astounded. I was flabbergasted. Highly recommend this. I have yet to use it on a power supply that is bad, but once I do, you can bet I'm going to know for sure. So, that's basically all you really need to know about the power supply tester. I'm going to quickly unplug everything here for you. I'm going to turn off the power supply, and you'll see it's about to turn off. So, I'm going to unplug everything really quick. And I'm going to show you all the little diggity doodads about this thing. 
And another cool thing is, let's say one of your SATA power connectors doesn't work. Or one of your Molex power connectors doesn't work. You can tell which ones are fine and which ones aren't by going one by one with this thing. And you can tell specifically which one is wrong for sure. Now, when you get the power supply tester, keep in mind that there are some rubberized parts to it. Like right here. This is actually your SATA port. Now you're going to say, where is it? Simple. You just undo the rubber casing. And that is your SATA power supply tester. Over here, same thing, it's your Molex power supply tester. Right here is your 20 or 24 pin power supply testers. You can see, it'll say right here, from this point, so over here is a 20 pin, from this point all the way over to over here is a 24 pin total. Here, you can see, um, it'll tell you your 8 pin or just 4 pin if all you have is a 4 pin on your power supply and your 6 pin. Everything is clearly labeled really easy to use. You don't have to be a genius or an electrician to understand what the heck this is saying. Everything is spelled out clearly easily. And that's what I love about this compared to other ones because the overall feel of this tester just screams high quality. It, it feels solid. It doesn't feel like it's cheap. It's not a cheapo depot kind of deal here. This is Antec. This is Antec. Now granted, some Antec cases aren't all they're cracked up to be, but this, this is. I love this. It, uh, I actually go around fixing computers a lot, and I've been waiting to get one of these because a lot of times people have really crappy power supplies. You need to know if it's working. This little baby's gonna help me out a lot. Came in this case. Um, just says comes in different languages. Has all this stuff right here. Uh, it's too glossy on here. It's gonna reflect. You can't really see what it says. But all in all, this is a completely kick-ass product. And I personally wouldn't trust any other power supply. To be honest with you. And you'll be hard-pressed to find good reviews on the internet for the Antec power supply tester. I don't know why, but you can't really seem to find any places that have good reviews. So I thought I would make you guys a nice, beautiful 1080p HD review. And you know what? It was definitely worth my time to tell you guys about this. More people need to know about this product. Once again... Highly recommended. I've said that a million times by now, as you know. But this little baby is going to save your life one day. This is Andrew Esquivel signing off. Buy it.